Hello friends, in this video we are going to see a detailed information about trial frame. Trial frame is an important equipment to do subjective refraction. So first we are going to see what is trial frame. Trial frame is an eyeglass frame. We insert different lenses in the trial frame to give clear vision to the patient. This is the image of trial frame. Usually trial frame has 4 compartments. But some trial frame have 3 compartments also. In the first compartment which is closer to the eye is used for insertion of high powered lens and in second compartment we insert spherical lenses. We insert cylindrical lens in the third compartment. We need to align correct axis for the cylindrical lens. That's why we insert cylindrical lens in the third compartment. This image clearly shows the axis of the cylinder. In the fourth compartment, we insert accessories like prism, occluder, pinhole, red and green goggles. And this image shows the compartment in trial frame. The trial frame should be properly placed to the patient. We need to adjust the interpupillary distance. Horizontal and the vertical line are displayed in this picture. Horizontal line should be aligned horizontally at the center of the pupil. And the vertical line should be aligned vertically at the center of the pupil. This alignment is done through adjusting this knob. Vertex distance should be optimum. Vertex distance is the distance between the front surface of the cornea and the back surface of the lens. In trial frame, the vertex distance means it is the distance between the eye and the trial lens. If the vertex distance is too large means it modify the power. Especially in high myopia and high hypermetropia patients. Ophthalmic frames are designed to have the vertex distance of 13 mm. The trial frame should be in pantoscopic tilt position. Pantoscopic tilt means uh, the bottom of the frame should be close towards the eye. By doing this, the trial frame lens power value and the final spectacle power value is same. We need to fit properly the trial frame to the patient. The pantoscopic tilt is especially helpful for presbyopic addition lens patients because they feel very comfortable while doing near work. If this content is useful for you means like the video, leave your opinion in the comment section. If this content is helpful for your friends means share this video. For regular optometry updates, subscribe the channel Optom A to Z.